welcome to my office and uh, um, it's a pleasure to be here and so I'm open to questions. Some I'll be able to answer, some I won't uh, as I am relatively new in the job. So is there someone who wants to go first? Well, what's, okay. your, pri what's your priority? Ed? Well, I think you've all, all seen the letter that uh, the, pr the Premier sent to myself and uh, so we're, we're in the process of going through those and trying to put in place the various uh, um, things that were outlined. Uh, we're putting in place the, the governance model, um, the uh, decentralization, uh, looking at how we can deal with mental illness and drug, drug addiction and the challenges of uh, continuing care. So we'll work through each of those, but it's you know learning the process, learning the people and trying to figure out where the other things are in the building. So, <laughs> On the governance model, are we going away from the, uh, do you anticipate going away from the super board kind of idea? Well, you know, I, I think we'll wait till the information comes in. Um, I think one of the really important things mm -hmm. is to is to try to move the the ability to make decisions down to those who are making those decisions and not interfere with them. I think that's really a vitally important thing. How that looks, how that's structured is, is really um, something we'll have to see, but that's the goal. And um, I don't see any reason why we can't do that. That doesn't mean that we're not going to have some centralized services, you know, uh, some cute IT and and and, uh, head and, I, and and finance and things like that. But the fact of the matter is, is that I think that the time has come to take a look at how we can get some decision making back in the hands of those who are delivering the service. What do you think about the fact that you have one of the biggest budgets and yet you're an unelected minister? Well, we will try to get elected. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, uh, uh, the Premier had confidence in putting us in charge of this portfolio and uh, we look forward to working with him. Uh, What's going to make you a good health minister? What can you bring to the table? Oh, I, uh, the guy upstairs in 307 says I'm doing a good job. That would be one big step. Uh, I think personally I have to feel I'm doing a good job and that we're accomplishing the things that we set out to do. And I think I can, as an individual, uh, know that uh, uh, I'm satisfied with it. Um, you know, when I was mayor, it wasn't what other people thought. It's what I thought. And if I believe I'm doing the right thing and we're moving down a path that's going to be successful, I have to stay on that path. And if there's some criticism, we'll deal with that. But that's really the guiding principle. It's what you think yourself.